ring ones, but now Liz is back in the spotlight on the cover of yet another major magazine. Glamorous Elizabeth Hurley has her hands full juggling three careers, Estee Lauder model, actress, and producer of boyfriend Hugh Grant's new movie, Extreme Measures. Sometimes it gets a bit much and I throw myself in my bed and cry. But on the whole, um, I, you know, I'm striking whilst the iron's hot, so I might be doing absolutely nothing this time next year, so I don't mind working hard now. On this busy day, Liz rushed from the set of Extreme Measures to slip into some sexy gowns for the cover of Marie Claire magazine. I love dressing up, yeah. I like it. I like girls and boys dressing up. I always have more fun. I don't think I've been out of the house since I was about 12 without makeup. Isn't that shameful? I know, it's awful. We started too early. But when she and Hugh dress up and go out in the town, Liz does not leave work behind. We talk a lot of business, but that's what I like doing. I mean, if I go out for dinner, I'd much rather talk about projects I want to develop and I want to, you know, projects I might have my eye on, I want to buy. I find that really interesting. You can judge for yourself how Elizabeth did. Her issue of Marie Claire magazine comes out in June. Hurley joined some legends in CoverGirl land, Cindy Crawford, Stephanie Seymour, and Frederic. The three got their start through the elite guest model search, and now fellow supermodel Ingrid is helping a new generation of supermodel wannabes. Before Ingrid walked the runway, before she was a Sports Illustrated swimsuit model, she was a teenager with a dream, and this is where her dream came true. Here we are at the Fashion Cafe where hundreds of girls are getting ready for the Elite Look of the Year contest. Yeah. Former winners Ingrid and Frederic cheered on the hopefuls. And the best part is to go to all these different places and um, make a lot of money. <laughs> the judges will select 20 finalists who will be flown to New York in June.